Right guys, welcome back to another video and today I'm going to be showing you my top 5 Cydia tweaks for the month of March 2014. So my first tweak is called Polis. This tweak allows you to get multiple icons accessible to you in Control Center. So in the settings of Polis, you can obviously select which apps that you want in Control Center. At the moment I have all my apps selected. You could also change the order of how your apps appear. Wouldn't it be cool to customize your iOS keyboard? This is exactly what color your board does. In the Cydia app, you are given a color palette and you can choose what color you want your keyboard and your control center to look like. All you need to do is save the color of your choice in the app, respring, then you are all set. Let's talk about Badger 7. This app gives you your notifications by simply tapping the app. So for example here, I double tap music and of course I don't have any notifications from that app Let's take a look at Facebook, and yeah, as I expected, no notifications from there either. You can adjust the invocation method in the tweak settings, the blur amount, how dark or light the animation is, and a whole load of other stuff. CCP Info for Control Center is a tweak which allows you to see everything about your device in a control center, such as your free memory, your IP addresses, etc. An extra settings tab comes with CCP Info called CC Loader. This is a really nice bonus in my opinion. This allows you to rearrange the order of your contents in your control center. My last tweak is called Slide to Kill 7, which basically allows you to kill all apps in your switcher by simply swiping down. This is a really handy tweak and it's free. There aren't many things to modify in this tweak apart from excluding apps from the kill all feature. Thanks for watching this video guys, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please click like like button down below, it really helps me out. Subscribe if you want to see more of my content and apart from that, that's it from me and I'll see you in the next video.